Sabi ho, Duterte is number one source of fake news. Sabi ho ng isa lang veteranang manunulat na journalist si Ellen Tordesillas. Uh, analyze ho natin to. <laughs> Yan ho si Ellen. <laughs> Sabi ho ni Ellen Tordesillas sa Very Files, Fake lies are concocted to deceive the public. Yun ho sinasabi natin kasi kanina. Yung motibo at intensyon. Okay. They confuse the public. Ginugulo nila at nililito ang publiko. Disempower them from making informed decision. Talagang hindi sila makakagawa ng tamang decision kasi fake yung mga, mga, mga bagay na inalalabas. The worrisome, ang nakakabahala di sa parting ito, ay that most karamihan ho ng mga sources yung pinanggagalingan ng disinformation a disinformation, e yung maling impormasyon, e nanggagaling daw, perpetrated, ginagawa, kakagawan daw ng ating gobyerno, government officials, on taxpayers' money. Whoa, 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 Ellen. <laughs> And the number one source of fake news, watch this guy, listen carefully, si Mr. President Duterte himself, in just one speech, nagbigay ho siya, Say, say, there's more than one falsehood. Now there goes another judgmental lady. I don't know kung ito writer talaga or another blogger. <laughs> Suriin ho natin, ha? analyze ho natin. Go line by line. Matalino pag-analyze sa auto. Kung sakaling nahihirapan ho kayo sa mabay, bababaan ko pa. A-analyze ho natin sa isipan ho ninyo at makita. Nagsalita ho to si Ellen Tordesillas at siya ho'y inaakusahan ng Pangulo, source ng fake news. True or false? Well, si Pangulo ba'y source ng fake news? Well, ma'am, Lady Tordesillas, I don't think, I don't think that's, that's a fact. I don't think that you have the accuracy of your fact. That is your opinion.